Mark here from Roland with the fantastic Axe Edge. This was the first Roland synth to have the Zencore synthesis system as its sound engine. Now with the latest update, you can download your sounds from Roland Cloud and expand your sound palette. With these amazing sound packs and expansions, I quickly made my own sounds, calling up an existing program and replacing each of the four tones available in an Axe Edge sound or program. I've used either an STZ file from one of the new sound packs or an EXZ or EXZ, depending on what part of the globe you're from, which is a wave expansion file. I love these sounds and there's so much movement and organic sound shaping happening that it, it's really inspirational stuff. If you're watching this video and you've just bought an Axe Edge, we should double check the system version. So press the menu right button to show the menu screen. Then use the cursor buttons to choose version info and then press the enter button. The version information screen appears. Don't perform the update if the product is already up to date. And never power off your Axe Edge while the update is in progress. If your version is less than 1.1, go to roland.com and look for the Axe Edge page and download the system update file. You'll need a USB and it needs to be formatted on the Axe Edge, so make sure you read the manual on how to do this. It's an archive file in zip format, so double click on the file to expand it to your computer's desktop. There should now be a folder with the file in it. And now to update your axe. An important note, don't turn it off while it's doing it. Copy the update file to the root directory of the USB and make sure the unit's off and then connect the USB to the USB memory port. Hold down the lock button and switch on the power. When the message Axe Edge Update appears, release the button and the update will start. The update process takes a few minutes to finish, but be sure never to switch it off. When you see the message, please power off, it's all done, and now it's okay to turn it off. Take the USB out and then switch on the power to the unit and verify that the version has been updated. Also on a side note for existing users, make sure that you update the Axe Edge editor to the latest version. So now let's install a new sound pack and a wave expansion. A sound pack is new patch data for the Zencore engine where wave expansion is completely new wave data and is everything from real acoustic pianos through to orchestras or even fully produced dance loops. These EXZs or wave expansions are ready to go sounds on their own in an initialized Zencore tone. Or you can use them as an oscillator or what Roland calls partials. This means you can use these sounds as core material to then process through an amazing Zencore filter, multi-step LFOs or effects and more. So on your formatted USB, copy the sound pack to the Roland sound folder. So the SDZ file goes to the Roland forward slash sound folder. And for your wave expansion EXZ files, copy them to the root directory of the USB. So now to import a sound pack, connect the USB and press the menu right button and then use the cursor buttons to select utility and then press the enter button. Use the cursor to select Import Tone and then press Enter. Use the minus and plus buttons to select the file that contains the tones that you want to import and press Enter again. Now cursor to select the tone that you want to import and then press Enter and it will add a plus symbol. Please note that to select or deselect all of the tones, hold down the Shift button and press the Enter button. Now press the cursor right button and use the minus and plus buttons to select the import destination tone and press enter, you'll see a little plus symbol. On a side note, be aware that the import destination tone that you select will be overwritten. An asterisk symbol indicates tones that are used in a program and if the import destination has fewer tones than the import source, not all of the selected tones will be imported. If there is a tone named init tone, it is automatically selected as the import destination tone and a plus symbol is automatically added. If you want to keep that tone, clear the plus symbol. Press the cursor right button and a confirmation screen appears. If you decide to cancel, press the exit button. To execute, press enter. And when import is complete, the message says import completed. To install a wave expansion, you need to hold down the enter button and turn on the power. The expansion screen appears. To uninstall an installed expansion, press the left cursor button. To install, press right. Press the right cursor button to move to the installation screen. Use the minus and plus buttons to select that file that you want to install and press enter. A confirmation screen appears and if you decide to cancel, you can exit out of there. 
As you can see, this is a fantastic update because not only can you get patches designed by some of the world's leading sound designers, it also expands your raw wave library with everything from orchestras to dance loops. The Axe Edge is part of an expandable platform so it can be updated with new sounds and capabilities and you can load Zencore sound packs and wave expansions for fresh sounds across a range of genres via your Roland Cloud Manager. I'm really excited about these new Zencore sounds and how good they sound. These new expansions have given the Axe Edge a new lease on life for me and it just sounds amazing. Thanks very much for watching.